section 167 after this citizens returned to their respective homes and the pandavas continued to dwell at ekachakra as before janamejaya said o brahmana what did those tigers among men the pandavas do after they had slain the rakshasa vaka by some pandava said the pandavas who came after slaying the rakshasa vaka continued to dwell in the abode of that brahmana employed in the study of the vedas within a few days there came a brahmana of rigid vows on to the abode of their host to take up his quarters there their host that bull among brahmanas ever hospitable on to all guests worshipping the newly arrived brahmana with the due ceremonies gave him quarters in his own abode then those bulls among men the pandavas with their mother kunti solicited the new lodger to narrate to them his interesting experiences the brahmana spake to them of various countries and shrines and holy rivers of kings and many wonderful provinces and cities and after this narration was over that brahmana o janani jaya also spoke of the wonderful self choice of ajna sena's daughter the princess of panchala and of the births of rishtadhumya and shikhandi and of the birth without the intervention of a woman of krishna draupadi at the great sacrifice of drupada then those bulls among men the pandavas hearing of these extraordinary facts regarding that illustrious monarch drupada and desirous of these extraordinary facts regarding that illustrious monarch drupada and desiring to know the details thereof asked the brahmana after his narration was concluded to satisfy their curiosity the pandavas said how o brahmana did the birth of tashtadhumya the son of drupada take place from the sacrificial fire how also did the extraordinary birth of krishna take place from the center of the sacrificial platform how also did drupada's son learn all weapons from the great bowman trona and who brahmana how and for whom and for what reason was the friendship between drona and drupada broken half why some pandava continued the question o monarch by those bulls among men the brahmana narrated all the particulars about the birth of draupadi thus ends the 167th section in the chaitra ratha parva of the adi parva